what is going on guys Vexory here in today's video i'll be discussing some topics and some frequently asked questions from you guys now some of these topics have been annoying me so i want to discuss them along with some questions that i get a lot so yeah let's get straight into the video all right so the first topic is about me making an rp server and the question is always are you going to make an rp server and every time i respond with no now there are multiple reasons why I say no and just the reason why I don't want to make RP server. Now the first reason is because I need to focus on better things right now. Right now me running a RP server isn't good for what I've been doing in life. Like I've been focusing more on school along with putting out more YouTube videos. So to be able to run a RP server and do school at the same time just adds more stress and I don't find it really worth it. Considering that there are multiple RP servers out there, I think right now is like an okay time to not start an RP server as there are plenty Greenville roleplay servers. Now that may guide you guys to saying just make an RP server for Southwest Florida. Well, I don't play Southwest enough. And then you have those people saying, oh, what if I make an RP server for you? I just don't want an RP server right now. I don't want an RP server under my name either. So that answers that question too. So that's basically why I don't want to make an RP server. There's just so many things going on right now. And I don't think I'll be making one. So yeah, next topic. Can you add me on Roblox or Discord? Now I get this question a lot, but here's the reason why you most likely never got added or even just like considered to be added on my friends list. The main reason is because the people who DM me asking could they be added on Discord or Roblox are the same people who never spoke to me a day in their life. As soon as I turn on my DMs in my Discord server, I either get a DM saying, can you add me on Roblox or can you add me on Discord? And the answer is just simply no, because if you never spoke to me a day in your life or you never even said hey or hi when you sent that message, then you just lowered your chance of getting added and then you know if you literally asked me to be added you basically lowered your chance of getting added because you know why ask to be added on someone's friends list when they never spoke to you and why are you asking to get added if they didn't send a friend request or even talk to you in the first place you get what i mean nothing much really else to it just don't do that to be honest and then another reason is I'm restricting my Roblox friend list to friends only as Roblox has a 200 friend limit. If you try to go over 200 friends, it'll give you an error saying your friends list is full. That's why my Roblox friends list is only true friends and it's not just random people. And then another thing, people question too many things that I don't want to answer like say a developer or hunter join the game they'll start asking can you add this card this card this card that's why i don't add random people i have people that are mature and chill and are not squeakers so you know yeah just saying yeah just another thing just saying i don't really add 13 year olds like that just saying just one thing to point out i don't add 13 year olds um so if that just messed you up then oh well i just don't so yeah all right, the next topic is actually the impersonators. Now, the next topic is actually the impersonators. Now, the impersonators are the group of people that I dislike the most, more than the haters. So the impersonators love to use my username and even my logo and channel art to impersonate me. Now, if you're one of those people and you're watching this video, I would highly suggest for you to stop impersonating people as it's not good and it's not a good look on yourself because in the end you'll get some Vuxery fans hating on you just because of what you did so I would not do it at all especially if you're taking someone's video and then putting your name over it and even people who just steal content in the first place like do not steal people's content and claim it as yours when People have already seen it on another channel that's more popular than you. It just makes yourself look stupid and bad and it's not really worth it. Then another thing, the way I handle them, I don't do copyright strikes. I just get my whole army to comment on your video saying take it down or whatever or imagine copying. So I kind of do it in a nice way so I don't have to copyright strike your channel to make you stop uploading and stuff. 
but i just get you to take it down so just do not do it and you know i take it really seriously especially if it's discord if it's a discord impersonator then i take it seriously because they can try to get you banned from many discord servers such as rp servers and even the greenville community server that everyone's in so i take it very seriously because i'm not trying to get blackmailed today and it's just too much to deal with to try to get you back in the server so yes do not do it and i would not suggest it at all Alrighty, another thing haters so haters seem to like like hating on people because they seen them take a w i noticed that like a lot like there was this one guy he said 7k in three years ain't it actually i've been doing youtube for one year which was march 27th actually march 17th 2020 that's when i started uploading consistent greenville videos and only greenville videos so that's when i actually started one year ago and there's just the haters that just hate on what you're doing like i'm not harming anyone on this platform nor am i talking about people like crazy on this app or nothing so i don't know what to say i'm not talking like big all bad i'm not trying to act like the biggest and coolest person out there because that's just not my style i'm just a chill relaxed youtuber so i don't see how i'm getting hated on by some when i check um held for review but who knows people always find a reason to hate and it's kind of just funny that's all i gotta say so yeah next topic okay i need to pull over for this one the fake volkswagen lovers slash the cringy i like this car to blah 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 now this is probably the most cringiest topic i'm going to discuss in this video just because it's just so like ill and just off so I've seen a lot of people say, oh, Voxery, I love Jetta 2. Oh, Voxery, I like Volkswagen 2. Now, in reality, most of you guys who say this line don't mean it. Y'all are just saying it to make me happy, and I find it very, very cringy. So, there's those people who are like, oh, yeah, Voxery likes a 2.5 Jetta. Oh, yeah, I like a 2.5 Jetta 2. Yeah, Voxery, you like golfs? I like golfs too. You want me to draw you a golf um, fan art? like i find this really cringy because people think i only like volkswagen and think i like every single volkswagen this is not the case people can take a picture of their base model jetta that they assume that i like and say oh fuck so you look at my new volkswagen you like my new volkswagen no i do not like every single volkswagen people get surprised when i say no i don't like it to a volkswagen because simply they think i like the whole company as a whole i really do not there are only certain volkswagens that i like and i don't only drive volkswagens you see this whole video i've been driving this shelby 350r which may or may not be my new car in greenville but you you know i don't drive volkswagens only look at my collection tesla it's a mix of everything tesla bmw bmw Colonin, Rolls Royce, um, WM, Corvette, first Volkswagen here, Shelby GT50, McLaren, and then there's a few Volkswagens in here, sure, 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 this last three is Volkswagen. I'm still working on my car collection though, and it's not going to be all Volkswagen. So, no, I do not like every single Volkswagen, and no, you guys do, most of you guys don't even like truly like Volkswagen for real, you are just kind of faking it, so my conclusion to this topic is be yourself don't try to be someone else that you're not it's really cringy at the end and it's just not worth it it's just like very weird just stop doing it that's the way i see it and i really just think that you guys should stop with it but yeah that'll be it for today's video i just wanted to discuss a few topics and yeah just been fuckery and i am out